After last week's big storm, I saw Cape Cod National Seashore cartographic technician Mike Tannis rolling his science wheel on Outer Cape beaches. Maybe it has something to do with erosion, I thought. So while Mike worked, I asked seashore mapping guru Mark Adams what was up. We saw Mike out there with an amazing wheeled science tool. What is that tool and what is he up to on the beaches of the Outer Cape? Well, that wheel uh, supports this little uh, GPS receiver, which is really quite state-of-the-art. It's a uh, survey-grade GPS, and which means that we can record not only your location on the ground, your XY coordinate, but also your Z coordinate, which is your elevation. And with XYZ, we have three dimensions of surveying. And when you have that, you can actually estimate areas and volumes of sand that gets moved around on the beach. Uh, any idea this past storm, what it might look like, or are you still waiting to crunch the numbers? We'll be taking our wheeled device and, and, and working up those measurements to see exactly what the volumes of sand are. And we can say with a lot of confidence that, you know, most places average about three feet per year of loss along the coastal bluffs of East Ham, Wellfleet, and Truro. Some years, some storms, more will go and, and some less. But um, so this storm is um, part of uh, that long term average, it's taken a chunk. Um, when we work up the numbers, we probably won't find that it's way out of the ordinary, but it, this, these are the, the pulses, the storm pulses that make up this long average. Talk a little bit about safety after a storm like this. Sure thing. Yeah, like none of this is stable and uh, gravity is going to do its work. And that, be that, that cliff that's been hollowed out at the bottom and in the middle these overhangs, it has to reach its angle of repose again, and the all the material that's that's kind of like balanced on the bluff is going to like slump down to the bottom, and it'll do it in sudden movements. You know, it can be quite dangerous. 